over to hook up he'll accept and cheat on his girlfriend will he oh man today was a crazy day today my team and i put together and executed yet Probably. another crazy loyalty test this time we were helping out clotille clotille wanted to find out if her boyfriend henry was truly loyal to her or not so we hired our friend jasmine okay. to hit on him and then ask okay. him on a date so why is it that you want to place henry would y'all fold i've been feeling like we've are y'all folding right here and I've asked, I've asked him about it. Oh, sorry. No, you're good. You're good. You're good. Damn, she must be getting it. cheated on, bro. It's like she flustering and shit. It off, so I'm like, okay, at least yeah. communicate how you're feeling, so I don't have to do this, you know? Right. We came up with a very elaborate plan, set up hidden cameras all around this park, and now we were just waiting on Henry to arrive so that our test could begin. Jasmine, of course, would be playing our decoy, but okay. we did have other key players in our test, like, like Anthony and Rachel. But okay, at the Rachel. of our entire test was our six month old puppy, you with the Koda. doggy. This guy is so heavy, I could barely carry him now. Jesus right, Christ, let me get into my position so where we've been streaming little. for a long time. Now he's all heavy. Like I probably only carry him like this now for like 10 minutes. Uh, yeah, this right here, this, a couple uh, months put the ago. chair back and a like little I said, bit. Today uh, he would be at the center of our plan. Yeah. We have a very elaborate test here, but everyone knows their roles, right? Rachel, right, Jasmine? Clotilde, you know the breakdown of the entire plan, right? Mm -hmm. What are your thoughts the on that? What are your thoughts <laughs> on the plan in general? The fucking basketball down. Don't do too much. <laughs> oh yeah, I ain't gonna lie. She's talking crazy. She's talking nah, she's talking correct. She's coming correct. Cause I ain't gonna lie, these other girls, they be doing a little bit too much, you feel me? She's letting them know now, nigga. Watch yourself. Girl, I'm known for flirting, so <laughs> Oh shit. She said I don't respect none of your boundaries. I'm gonna do me and if your nigga want me, he want me. <laughs> I'm known for flirting. What is that? But that's dead <laughs> true though. That's what I'm trying to that's figure out. Boop, 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 boop. Ping, 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 poo, poo. Like, to who? Whoever said that. She said, she said, girl, I'm known for flirting. That was her response after she said, don't do too much. And then I went, poo, 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 Right on her temple. Because now I fight. Why? Now I fight. That was a disrespectful thing to say. But you know what? I'm going to be disrespectful back. So, the poom 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 Those hits don't sound like it hurt. But she lucky I don't go poom poom poom. Ra ta ta ta. So. This is my opinion. No, I just get in my character really good, you know? <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Dang. So with everything set right. up and ready to go, all that was left to do was wait for Henry to arrive. I'm like scoping out the area right now. Where is he at? <laughs> but it's really just a waiting game at this point. Soon we will find out if Henry will be willing to trade Clotilde for our friend Jasmine. So with that being said, what the fuck? I hope you guys have your talkies hear? because you guys already know. This shit's gonna be good. You sure that's hey, okay in the video? Any, any, any news from Henry? Any ETA? Anything at all? Over. Yeah, I texted him. He said that he was still on his way and everything. Why is he like that? So the way that we managed to get Henry to come to this park was thanks to Anthony. See, thanks to Clotilde, we knew that Henry liked to play video games, so we decided to have Anthony pretend to want to sell this PS5. See, at the making of this video, PS5s are still sought after and very hard to come by. Nigga. Oh, I was about to say, because on Walmart, that shit is not 500, bro. That should say not. Matter of fact, this is cap. Let me, let me, let me, let me go. Let me go on Walmart right now, because that's what this website is, right? That shit is not 500. Because it is, I would have got one already. The only reason I didn't get one that I wasn't looking for is because it was available on Walmart. But yeah, it's available on Walmart. That shit's just 900 to 800 out. 800, 950. This this is cap right here. What do you mean the making of this video? When the fuck was this video made, nigga? Eight eight months ago. I um, tried to get you it last Christmas. You did? That shit was sold out quick. Wait, you tried to get me the PS Five last Christmas. So we spy. Yes. I didn't know. See, at the making of this video. Oh, that was Best Buy. I'm just fucking. Smart. I literally everywhere. I didn't know that. Thank yes, you. I appreciate you. Nigga, you should have went all in on one gift. What the fuck? Yeah, I I hate. You know what's crazy? That's what I hated growing up. Chad, y'all ever wanted for any of y'all that's even fucking awake? Have y'all ever just wanted one thing for Christmas? Like you didn't want multiple gifts. You just wanted one thing, but you know it was expensive. And your family just got you a bunch of bullshit. 
Like, nigga, y'all all could have, and it equals to the fucking game. Y'all all could have just chipped in for what the fuck I wanted. Like, that shit used to get me so tight as a kid, bro. I ain't gonna lie, that shit's 500. That shit is 500 on the, on the, on the. Yeah. So is then it, I, I ain't gonna lie. Is it refurbished? I don't know. So I ain't gonna lie, I'll look, I'll. PS5s so are still sought after to, and very hard to come by, so we took advantage of this once again and posted the PS5 onto Craigslist for $500 flat. Like, no taxes, game included, controller included, great condition, like, I would have been freaking on that. We then sent this post to Clotio, and she was responsible for intriguing and convincing Henry to get in contact with Anthony in regards to buying the PS5. When Henry finally got in contact with Anthony, we then instructed Anthony to schedule a meetup at this park at 11 a.m. What up, y'all? Today I'm selling my PS5, and I'm here every day at 11 playing b-ball. You know, hey man, I know I'm five foot five, but I'd be dunking on fools oh, so all day. Nigga put his PS5 up for sale, and your boyfriend just randomly seen City it. City High School always scoring them buckets, lettered every year that I was playing. Yeah, Nothing but buckets, right. cause I'd be balling. Y'all know. <laughs> See, as a cover story, Anthony told Henry that he usually balls up here at 10 in the morning. So why not knock out two birds with one stone? Anthony can sell Henry his PS5 when he comes and balls up at this park. Okay. That's cat, but okay. Oh. Hello? Henry? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I just wanted to confirm that you guys, you were still going to make it out here. Okay, I'll be there at the park in about half an hour. Is that cool? Okay. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll be there in a bit. Okay, sounds good, bro. I'll see you here. So we know that Henry saw his way. He's still coming. <laughs> He's gonna be so disappointed that he doesn't get his feet. So after about 20 minutes of just waiting around, Henry finally arrived to the park. Is this him? Is this him? Yeah, 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 that's him. Are you positive? It is a white... Yeah, it's Henry. Alrighty guys, everyone, Henry is here. This is Henry, just got confirmation from Clotio. This is Henry, over. With Henry now here, we could now send Jasmine in. She has been hiding with Coda out of sight all this time. Hey, Anthony, has uh, has Henry texted you anything at all? Over. Yeah, actually he just texted me that he's here and he wanted to know how far out I was. Okay, if anything, um, don't really respond to him, kind of ghost him, but we're gonna send in Jasmine here in about like two minutes. Over. Roger that, leave him on red, got it. This is the suspenseful part, where we just sit and wait. What the fuck, girl? Why so Rachel, and Jasmine, and Coda's like rules like actually go scene. hand in hand. Back Rachel back is back. pretending to be Coda's owner. A couple days ago though, Coda ended up running off. Heartbroken, Rachel decided to make some lost dog flyers and post them around her neighborhood. Well, it just so happened that Jasmine ended up finding Coda along with Rachel's flyer. Jasmine contacted Rachel and they agreed to meet today. Unfortunately yeah. though, Jasmine's phone ended up dying and now she has no way of contacting Rachel. All right, Jasmine, come on in and make your entrance. Over. I don't do too much. <laughs> Jasmine oh, she is said, don't do too much again. Determined to return Coda and collect her cash though. So she's I mean, decided she's to supposed ask... to do too much though. What the fuck? Nigga, see if your nigga is loyal. It's a stranger to borrow I their phone. That, like that quote unquote stranger will of course be Henry. Look at that okay, I see Jasmine dude. walking up and to Henry's car. Really, I'm saying Coda looks great, of course. So there was one thing that did have me a little worried. See, Jasmine wore a tank top because it was a hot day. Because of this, we clipped and hit her mic in her bra, but her mic pack was bulgy. To the untrained eye, you couldn't even tell what it was. Nonetheless, though, we still told Jasmine to try to keep her back towards Henry as much as possible, and we also gave her some excuses that she could give in the event that Henry were to ask her, yo, what's that bulgy thing in the back of your bra? Hey, sorry, I don't mean to bug you, but do you mind if I use your phone? I'm supposed to meet somebody up. To, um, I found their dog. Uh, my phone died, so I can't really let them know that I'm not working. Bro, I'm not trusting anyone that runs up on me like this, bro. In the nah, I don't got a phone, sweetheart. Patient they wanted me? Yeah. Um, do you mind if I just use your phone really quick? Uh, yeah. That's that fine. Can we go to the shade, though? It's kind of hot for him. Oh, Henry's getting out of the car. Henry has fallen right into the first phase of our plan. He has agreed to let Jasmine borrow his phone so that she could contact Rachel. Okay. After taking his phone, Jasmine hands- Imagine, bro, I ain't gonna lie. If I'm in a situation and I really, like, I'm loyal, and I'm loyal, and I pass this test, I'm breaking up with her. And I'm smacking all the producers and all the- Because, nigga, I, he literally just came for a PS5, bro. He literally just came for a PS5. 
Dakota over to Henry and begins pulling out the missing dog flyer from her back pocket. Yeah, I found him and they're actually giving a reward. Oh, really? Yeah, like a thousand dollars. Yeah. With Henry now knowing about the big payday, Jasmine dials Rachel's number so that she could come pick up Coda. I would have took off with the dog just now in the flyer. I would have took off with the dog and the flyer and just got my one thousand dollars. She's calling. Hello? Hi, Rachel, it's Jasmine. I know we were supposed to meet up at the dog park, but I'm using someone else's phone. My phone died. Uh -huh. um, I don't know if you want to meet me. I'm right across the street, I think, from the dog park. I'm at a, okay. um, by a basketball court. I don't know if you're too familiar with it. Oh, there. yeah, yeah, the basketball court. That's literally right across the street. Yeah, I'm actually going to be there in like less than five minutes. I can just meet you at the basketball court then. Okay, yeah, that's fine. All right, we'll see you here. You don't sound okay, too well, concerned about it, Thank you so much, Jasmine. I'll see you soon. Thank you. Bye. You sound too concerned about her dog. Thank you Look, this so ain't got much. The dog the Do you mind waiting here with me? I just, just in case I need to call her again or sure, something. Yeah. yeah. And just like that, Henry has now. Nigga, after that call, I'm making my call to my PS5. Fallen into fuck? the second phase of our plan. He has agreed to hang out with Jasmine until Rachel face. gets there. It's Where'd you find hot. this guy? Um, actually, I found him in this park, but like all the way down there, he was by himself. And then I found the flyer, and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna be nice. Yeah. I mean, I would have done it even if there was no yeah, reward, but, nice. but yeah. yeah, there's yeah. a reward of also. I mean, and you said a thousand. A thousand dollars. I mean, she must love her. I ain't gonna lie. I, my dog go missing, bro. I put a thousand dollars. I'm fucking lying, bro. Bro, I see you, bro. I'm like, oh yeah, give me the dog. I'm about the cat. I'm walking away. What are you gonna do? Steal my dog back? What the fuck? Like so much. So we're just gonna give them a little bit of time to like talk, make acquaintances and everything, and then I'll be driving up pretty shortly. And then I'll grab Coda and then she can make her move. What what were you doing? Uh, I'm just gonna wait here for a PS5. Okay. I'm basically gonna buy it. Yeah. Uh, how long have you been waiting? I'm um, not too long. I've been here for a couple of minutes now. Though. We wanted Jasmine and Henry to be pretty comfortable with each other before Jasmine makes her move. Jasmine asking him out right then and there or too quickly could possibly cause Henry to grow suspicious that something is up. Is, so everything's cool right now, right? Is everything pretty, pretty chill, pretty decent, right? Like he's just being right now a good Samaritan, just letting her use her phone, hanging out there with her right now. Jasmine and Henry spent a couple of minutes just talking and getting to know each other. Throughout Bro, their conversation, the Henry part, frequently nigga. checks his phone. I'm assuming in an effort to get a hold of Anthony. Hey, Anthony, is, is Henry calling you? I think he might be calling you. Over. Yeah, he called a couple times, but I didn't answer. Over. No, yeah, I would have been dumb tight. Like, like, one more time just to kind of, you know, break the ice, I guess you could take with Henry. Over. Roger Anything that. Nigga come for a PS5, what a dog got to do for this nigga? He's waiting there for a PS5, but the nigga is ghosting, but he's only been there for a few minutes. And then she walked up to him saying, can I use your phone? Because I found the dog that was missing. And that's the excuse to, that's the excuse for her to talk to him and get comfortable. Comfortable. That, over. Have you texted him too? Yeah, Multiple I mean, times. I've been hitting him up, but. And there's a dog park that literally across the street. Hopefully nothing bad happened to him. Um, that or he just wasted your time and just. Like, I thought she was a flirt. Was can, a I hear can I hear something? Can I hear some ribs? After a couple more minutes of just chilling and waiting, we were now ready to move on to phase three of our plan. Alrighty, Rachel, go ahead That's and make your entrance. Over. Alright, let's go time. Thank you for waiting for me. Yeah, for sure. Actually, I, mean, I was gonna wait either way. But I mean, you would have waited in your car instead of outside. Yeah, I'm sorry. Well, See, I came here walking. Like I said, it might be cooler out here. All right, guys, we've queued Rachel to make her entrance. This is her right I here. I would have never did this. I would have got back in my car, and if she called, I was like, "Yeah, I got you." Like she calling. Coming in with the truck, she is coming in to supposedly pick up. I just don't touch people. The person you bought it off was a guy. Yeah, it's a guy. Oh. I feel like every car you see now, it's like, is that him? <laughs> I think that might be Rachel, actually. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Rachel? Okay. Coda, look. Aww. Hey, so the happy. dog is a hoe. The dog is a hoe. He dead pulled up on. Is that really her dog? What the fuck? 
Is everybody a paid oh, actor? Yeah, <laughs> like, <why laughs> yeah I'm with the phone. Thank you so much. Rachel is finally reunited with Coda. She now prepares to hand Jasmine her reward, but she has a little surprise for her. Now I told you a thousand, but. Here's two thousand. Two thousand. I he's he's like my best friend. He literally is like wow. Me, and and I cannot crazy. thank you enough for doing this. Like yeah, two thousand. Are you like, really? Are you I'm, sure? I'm serious. Please take. I got like two thousand. So Rachel went to handing like, oh Jasmine a bigger reward than what she originally offered. I After doing so, Rachel then thanks Henry and Jasmine one last time, and she and Coda make their exit. Both of their roles are officially complete. This is crazy. That is a lot. Yeah. We were now at the final stretch of our plan. That, that, by this point, Jasmine and Henry right are well acquainted and now finally by themselves. Okay, so this is where she's gonna start getting into asking him on a date. Okay, Clotio. Jasmine could also use the $2,000 in her hand to her advantage if she felt like she really needed to. Yes, it was prop money, but her thinking was that Jasmine could invite Henry to like a fancy romantic restaurant. Nigga, he don't want Honestly, a fancy though, romantic restaurant. Honestly, that was pretty dumb and unnecessary PSL. because Henry's a guy. Oh, ain't lie, you help me and shit. I, I, let me use your phone, you wait here for me. He's obviously flaking on you. Let's go get that PS5. For, let me go buy it for you. Feel me? Like, PS5 is only like And I don't really think guys need that much convincing to cheat if they wanted to cheat. Anyways, though, the point I'm trying to make is that Jasmine is now in the perfect position to make her move. I know this might sound weird and coming from a girl, like if this is out of the ordinary, something I really wouldn't do, but I'm going to throw it out That's there. Cap. Don't like freak out or anything. I think she's making a move. But I don't know. Would you, um, are you single? Yeah. You're single? Like, <laughs> I think say, <so>, yeah. <laughs> There's no other girl, no, nobody well, else. I was just, I was just in a, I uh -huh. just got out of a relationship, but. And that's done. And you're I not. just noticed, this is what you get for dating out of side of chocolate. You just stayed in that chocolate yeah. lane. That's your problem. Talking to anybody else? No, not right now. Okay, well, I'm single, you're single, and. Um, I would have been like, bae, I don't want her, bro. I don't want her, bro. I'm just using her because I see she got an extra band. She might be nice. Get me a PS5. I can have two PS5. You never know. You like to go on a date, maybe, with know. me? You seem pretty chill. Like, I like your attitude. And you're really nice. You help me out with everything. I don't know if you would consider going out on a date with me. Yeah, like some yeah. Like yeah, like for real. Like, I would I would like to get to know you more. Yeah. Yeah? yeah You'd be down? Cool. Yeah. Okay. Well, when are you free? Um, I'm free this Saturday. This Saturday? Okay, yeah, that that works. I work all week, so Saturday will be good. Yeah, yeah. Damn. I'm confused. Like, what? What's going through your minds? What do you What are you thinking? What it, do you... it seemed like so natural. Like, how long have you been doing this for? Like, how long have we not been together? And just like that, Henry has agreed to go on a date with Jasmine and takes down her number. I'm gonna go out there and tear him up. You drink? Yeah. Are you what? Like tequila, vodka? I like more. I'm more, like more of a whiskey guy. Are you romantic? Are you those type? I like to be. I like to be. Yeah? yeah. You're like a very committed person. Right. Yeah. Exactly. Bro, she's asking mad questions. Like niggas just be so damn bad, bro. Like. Like, I'm not even talking about being loyal. Like, I'm not even talking about being loyal. I'm talking about if I was single right now, like, bitch can't ask, a young lady can't ask me all of these questions. Like, like, first of all, a woman asks you, a woman being more into you than you are is already suspect. No matter who you are, nigga. It's already suspect. And then just asking all these questions, it's like, bro, I can't talk to people. Like, I just can't give, I just can't give people the answers that they want. So, with, like, I feel me? Like, I don't know how niggas be getting caught, bro. You know, I expect that from my other person. So. Oh. So I don't even, I don't, I don't even want to hear him anymore. I don't want to hear him anymore. Okay, now I really want to get your guys' thoughts here. Do you guys think that Henry failed or passed this test? He passed. Like, he I get it. Get like, Henry didn't up. do anything with Jasmine yet. He didn't kiss her. He didn't go on a date with her. He didn't do anything at all with her, right? But remember, though, he did say that he was single, and he did say that he didn't have a girlfriend at all. So that's why I want to know, like, do you guys think, like, that's enough to propagate a fail? Like I said, like, how long has he been doing this? How long has he been dra dragging this on? Like, yeah. how? She should go in for a hug. He accepted to go on this date because it's being nice. No, that's not being nice. Like, you're in a relationship. Mm -hmm. That's no, not I being nice. That's cheating. I was about to literally no, ask you that. Like, would you consider that cheating? Yeah, that's cheating. Yeah. I, watch the I don't accept dates from guys. Like, Some people would say that, oh, he hasn't even done anything. Yeah, but he basically said that we're not in a relationship, that he's single, that he broke up with me, and, like, I'm living in a whole different world than he is. Like, I feel it. And who cares what they say? Bye.
<laughs> You're not in my relationships. But. Yeah. <laughs> so I personally gotta agree with Clotilde here. In my opinion, I think Henry failed this test. Yeah, he did. I get it. He I mean, didn't he do anything with Jasmine, but he did tell her that he was single. He did tell her that he wasn't seeing anyone despite being in a relationship with Clotilde. Like, I mean, if Henry plans on going on a friendly date with Jasmine, why not be straight up with her and tell her, I do got a girl, but I am down to go on a friendly date. What the date fuck is a friendly date, cool you person. bitch? But again, that's you just my opinion. Hair, I know some of you what guys may have different terms you in your guys' relationships. So I want to know, date? do you guys think I don't Henry understand passed that. or failed this test? Let's have a conversation in the comments below. Did he tell you like uh, an exact time? Yeah, well, we just kind of confirmed that we we're meeting up here and I said, I'm going to head out. He said he was going to head out. So I mean, he's yeah. been here by now. Well, hopefully he does come. Yeah. And it's too hot to be waiting. It really is. You waited with me uh, for the owner to come. So, I mean, I don't mind waiting with you. If that's fine with you. Yeah, I mean, I'm kind of blowing up his phone. So despite Henry having already agreed to go on a date with Jasmine, this test was far from over. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. All she has to do is like, come on, let me go get you the PS5 right now. You see, I got an extra band from that, from, from the reward. Nigga, like, just get, shorty, you said you was good at flirting, bro. You, I ain't had no flirting yet. Get straight to it. Say so you want to go on a friendly date? No. Right now, Jasmine is just chilling and talking to Henry, and she has invited him to go to Starbucks. I should have told you guys this in the beginning, but we wanted to make this video a little bit different than the rest. See, if Henry were to fail, we wanted to see if Jasmine could seal the deal even further with him and solidify his intentions with her. The plan was for Jasmine to offer to buy Henry some Starbucks as a thank you for letting her use his phone. Starbucks, Once at Starbucks, go all the Jasmine way, would nigga. then invite Henry to come I'm back glad. to her. I guess you can't go all the way. Cause I ain't gonna lie, if a girl says she has a PS5 with me right now, bro, all I gotta do is go on a date with her, nigga. I'm going on a date. What the fuck? I'm going on a date. Try to run up on me. Good yeah. like Charlie. You like how I roll up in the mall. Walking spot. I know life of the party. 1942. Cost a nigga my body. Millie J with the goddamn three months. Yeah. Oh, no. That's four months. Oh, my God. I can't read. Four months is crazy. You been up to me for four months? Good looking, gang. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Her apartment to oh, you know, Netflix crazy. and chill and whatnot. I mean, you guys get the picture. Do you just want to go to Starbucks and maybe text him on the way or something? Or call him? I mean, I'm no, no rush. Like, if you want to stay or you want to go. I mean, it's what, it's your choice. Like, Why oh, you keep looking at me like that? Like, bro, y'all would cheat for a Birkin bag, nigga. Y'all would cheat with a famous nigga. Y'all would cheat with a rich nigga and not get no money out of it. At least I'm cheating for something that's rare and obtain unattainable. Like, damn, it's just a friendly date for a P5. You looking at me all types of crazy. Like, like you want to get it? Like, we can go get Starbucks right now. You can call and text him on the way. Coming out Wolverine, nigga, got a war, nigga. Like, damn. Seven hours, well, something I mean, like that. Here, seven hours, my hours. I mean, you could always wait. And then turn around. Cap, and come first of all, yeah. no, that's not. And just cap. like that, Henry that's is not falling cap. into our extended plan. Being that Jasmine supposedly oh, wants here. Fuck happened? Just like that, Henry has fallen into. I, I mean, you could always wait. Like whatever you, know what? you want to I mean, do, and call or stay. What the fuck happened? Offered Jasmine would then invite Henry to come back to her apartment you to, said you know, cat. Netflix and yeah, chill and whatnot. I mean, you guys get the picture. Don't get no money Do you just want to go to Starbucks and maybe text him on the way or something? Or like, yeah. call him? I mean, I'm no, no rush. Like, if you want to stay or if you want to go. I mean, it's what, it's your choice. Like, we can go get Starbucks right now. You can call or text him on the way. Whatever you, know you want to I mean, if he gets like, here, like, I mean, you can always, yeah, like, and then turn around. Nah, I just broke this up. Like, it's like my heart is literally just breaking right now. Like, that niggas is devious. Yeah, bad, yeah. That's why you got to rock. Just like that, what the Henry fuck? has fallen into our extended plan. Being Yo, William, Jasmine thank you for the follow, gang. I appreciate here, you. They make their way into Henry's car. Oh, oh bro, this is devious, bro. <laughs> You're good. All right, guys, here we go. This is she it. Really Jasmine is getting into Henry's car. Get ready. Over. Like, she didn't even offer to buy the PS5. She offered Starbucks. Okay, guys. Like, no so they are off. We don't want to make Starbucks. this suspicious like, at fuck? all. So we're giving them a couple of seconds to get ahead. Niggas we know exactly where they're going. going so we're all good. Let's give them five more seconds, four more right. seconds, three more seconds, two. She's literally getting... Hey, bro, I ain't gonna lie. No girls getting in my front seat, nigga. No girls getting in my front seat, nigga. Unless I'm cheating. Bitches got to sit in the back. 
I, it, it just is what it is. One, okay. This is disrespectful. Policy, go ahead. And this is why you stay with, you feel me? You, you try to date outside of Thailand. And this is what you get. Because black men don't cheat. Our extended plan was in full swing. A part of our crew headed off to follow Henry and this Jasmine. Is crazy. This is like we I was saying it was suspenseful earlier, like waiting for Henry to get here. Now this is so more What are they gonna do? Make a fucking scene at Starbucks? What are they gonna do? I don't get like, it. Ooh, I'm all worked up this now. Why you stay single? <laughs> Remember guys, also after you guys record them going into the Starbucks, Ooh. just make your way back to the apartment. Over. Did you take them back to the back over here with Rachel. Over. Roger that. Over. Yeah, she's dumb right tight there, right, right there. Look at them, they're right there. Okay, we're gonna step outside. We're gonna grab Coda, say bye to Rachel, because she's actually gonna be taking oh off right God, now. Butterfly and then we're gonna make our way back to the apartment. So unfortunately, we weren't gonna be able to hear Jasmine inviting Henry back to her supposed apartment. Why? But we did tell her to just be straight up and as upfront as possible yeah, as like, to why, why she wants him back? to come back to her place. After grabbing Coda and parting ways with Rachel, it was now time for us to head back to the apartment. <laughs> Sorry. After grabbing Coda and parting ways with Rachel, it was now time for us to head back to the apartment. By this time, Jasmine and Henry had already Yo, arrived bro. at Starbucks. Do you think that he's that actually going to go through with it? Do you think that he's actually... I mean, at this point, he shocked me. Like, right. So, I'm not even sure what he's capable of doing anymore. Right, I, I thought like I knew him. So after a good 10 minute drive, uh, we eventually made our coffee, way back bro. to our apartment complex. We parked the car and then headed inside. Having completed their mission, our follow team began making their way to us as well. Whoa! Excuse me? You would get mad if I went to go get coffee? Audio? <laughs> oh, it's Denzel, everyone! Denzel is cutting! Hmm? Oh, I don't get you coffee. You don't even drink coffee. When do you ask for Starbucks? We ended up interrupting Denzel's lunch, but he was cool with letting us finish this test. At the end of the day though, if anything else was gonna go down, it would all be up to Henry. Jasmine should have invited him to come over by now, and whether he agrees to have a good time with her or not, was now completely <laughs> up to him. Otl and Henry Clo Oh damn, I can't fuck. All right, guys. So Jasmine just texted me that she is coming right, up on. the yeah. elevator right now. Jasmine did her job and invited Henry. Now, I ain't gonna to lie, don't get her out the kitchen. I still want to see if she he will go further. Like what Over the fuck he's trying to do right now? for some fun and a good time. As I'm sure many this? of you expected, it appeared that Henry ended up accepting that invitation. Give me your phone. What you want to do with it? Hey. What the fuck? You're single? He said, what the We're fuck? Done? What the fuck is going on? What do you mean? Nah, this is mad fake. This is mad fake. Nigga, I'm right here. I say, what the fuck? I see my girl, nigga. I'm looking back. I'm going out the door. What the fuck? I'm not continuing to walk in. And I, nigga, oh, you're going to walk out. Nigga, yeah, I'm going I'm to be home already. By the time y'all open that door, I'm already be home, nigga. I'm going to be like, what the fuck? You going to come home talking bullshit? I'm like, what are you talking about? I've been here the whole day. I'm not a narcissist. It's just that you have no proof. Really on video. If you open this door and you don't see me and you FaceTime me and I'm home, there's no, like, there's nothing you can tell me. You're single? We're done? What the fuck is going on? What do you mean? No, I don't have to explain shit to you. What are you doing here? Just gonna hang out. Who's this? Where'd you meet her at? What'd you mean? Just tell her now nah, why she's smiling like it was your racist. <laughs> oh wow. Then what y'all do? Here? What, what the fuck is that? Like, what, what do you mean what the fuck? I don't I don't explain shit to you. What the fuck out. are you doing here? Do we really want to do this right now? Yeah. yeah, I brought them here for a reason. It's just, no. Look, all right. Let's just go outside. No, no. Like, why no. the fuck we're doing this? Before? Why are you here? Hands, explain. Who's this? Where's my Starbucks? <laughs> so Henry, just so you know, like this entire thing was basically like all a test. Clotil <laughs> watched and heard everything that he said to Jasmine when Jasmine like approached Wait, did, you at But the it park. didn't say that he bought it for her, feel me? He bought it for him. So it is what it is. He bought, she bought it for him. It's, it's, it's so she heard you right say now. that like you he got some neck? What the fuck? You were that single, that tough. you just broke up with your girlfriend. She heard you agree to go on a date with Jasmine. Like, she was watching and listening to everything. Like I said, this entire thing was I like, like that's cap. And you failed, so. Yeah, well, you're crazy. I'm crazy. Look at this, look at this. 
What the fuck is this? This is not how you... And I even asked you, like, are you loyal? Are you honest? Like, I gave you so many opportunities to say, like, you know, but you... I'm crazy and you're unfaithful, so... Why are you setting me up like this? I don't understand. I literally feel you pulling away. I kept asking you, what's wrong? What's okay, going on? Just talk to me. I literally tried talking to you. You wouldn't say anything. You just brushed me off. This isn't the mature thing to do. <laughs> He's right though. This is not very mature. This is not mature to film me. Film me. This is not very mature of her to spy on him and get paid actors. Like this is not fair. Like bro, she just got an extra rack, nigga. I thought she was gonna give me the PS5. That nigga flaked on me. It's not like bro. I thought I was coming to get a pit. Nah, I would have blacked out. I would have blacked out. This nigga thought he was getting a PS5, bro. And look what the fuck going on. I would have blacked out. I don't care. You didn't fucking answer me. That wasn't mature. Blacked out. You didn't communicate your feelings. Who's right? Who's so, wrong? Nigga. What's up? My P5. What are you gonna do? What, what are we about to do? Like, what are we about to do? I'm fucking crazy. Saying. Don't gaslight like me. Whole you got her Starbucks first mind. PC set up back down. You know my favorite drink. Two years. I just don't understand why would you you would do this. It's just fucking crazy. You don't fucking do this to me. Well, she tried talking to you. I mean, when, when okay, a girl... Okay, really, this is not how you go about it. This is fucking crazy. Okay, well, I talked to you. You calling me crazy is just Nick changing is always going to fold regardless. Everything she did was necessary. Oh, my God. I don't know. I think... Me and Millie J. <laughs> Let me just play the video. Trying to manipulate me. Make me feel bad. Whatever. Wow. You still cheated. I didn't, though. You did though. So if a guy would have walked up to me and I was like, "Oh, I'm single, yeah, yeah. Like, let's go on a date Saturday when we're supposed to have dinner with my mom." Yeah, but I didn't. What do you consider cheating? Because I'm confused. Because you know you would be mad if I did this. He ain't cheat though. If we be honest, he ain't cheat. He did. He went to the definition. This is not the definition of cheating. He went to Starbucks. It's not. This is not cheating. He went to Starbucks. I ain't gonna lie. Because you, you smart enough to know once you figure out. Okay, I'm not. PS5. I'll come and say like anything after that you're getting You sound upset. Like you taking this personal or something. Like this happened to you before. I didn't this is a black woman. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. I was like, I'm not gonna be on his side no more because he cheating on my black queen. On a black woman on a PS5 are you kidding? But he didn't cheat. I wouldn't set you up like this in the first place. But if I would have... <laughs> Why you want to fight me? I'm just saying, he didn't cheat. Yes, he, he, did. he did. He was going back to the crib to rob her, nigga. Clearly, she got thousands. She got she got extra bread to buy her star Starbucks. He knew he was doing, nigga. Like, he trying to rob her. He did it, period. I'm, I'm not fucking, fucking this, crazy. Like, this is what y'all girls be saying. Y'all be saying, oh, niggas link anything. Next time, I'm just rob you. Like, nigga, it's the same shit. First, I don't even know. You don't even know me. You invited me to the crib. You don't know what he capable of. Nigga, I'm about to rob this whole crib, nigga. I'm about to rob this whole crib. That's basically all he okay. tried to do. That's all he tried to do. He tried to get that lick, nigga. She just made ex she just made two bands so of giving the dog back. Feel the me? Girl so comfortable. I ain't put my dick in it yet. <laughs> Terrible. That's she. Other way around, he would have dubbed her. Yeah, he would have dubbed her because she's not going in the problem. It's a difference. We on two different missions. Like, but if a girl's comfortable, comfortable house, you don't know her. That should be a red flag also. Nah, cause I got that thing on me, nigga. I got a gun, nigga. I don't, like, what the fuck? I'm gonna rob her. There's nothing you can say. There's but no. You don't know what she, what she's capable of doing. Not for you in the house because you want to get a dick at PS5. Listen. Like no. It sounds like a lot of y'all is hurt right now. I am hurt. Like, this yeah. is a melanin queen right like, yeah. here. Wrong by I don't even know what, did what he race do? he is. But... What did he do? <laughs> Right, I'm gonna stop trolling. <laughs> I am that <done>, done. <laughs> See, because I can act crazy. crazy. I ain't gonna lie. If anybody <laughs> did this to me, Thank bro. You, Millie J. If anyone did this to me, nigga, it's clip for them. I can act crazy. Bro, yeah, get I out the chair and let your girl be. You. <laughs> you said you were single. You said you're gonna go on a date with her. Yeah, but you can't blame me for something I didn't do. You're at her house. What were you gonna do here? Netflix and chill? I wouldn't set you up like this. Why, you, did, why did you say you were single? Listen, I'm just trying to make like why? Entertaining. How many other females? If she's already tried talking to you and you never like okay, didn't listen. I don't think this is anything to do. Oh uh, no, she's this in it now. We're in a yeah, fucking throuple now. Me. Shit, you brought her into our relationship. Our problems, we figured out. You and me. No, we gotta do all you just this. brought her. Nigga, she's not into this. She's not in the drama. 
uh, young lady. This is what I will disagree with you. Don't just leave her out of it. She's a fucking paid actor. Just leave her out of it. Just know that he does this with multiple people, and that's it. Don't 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 keep including her, nigga. It's so our relationship. What are you He's talking like, about? Y'all crazy. What the fuck? Okay, I'm fucking crazy and leave. What the fuck? So go home. No. I'm fucking up with my own door. Yo, he's dumb. <laughs> he's acting so fucking up with my own door. I'm fucking up with my own door. Okay. Don't disrespect her. Fuck everybody. Okay, fuck you too, Doc. Fuck everybody. <laughs> nah, niggas be mad when they get caught. That's something you would <laughs> bro, I'm taking a dick. If I get caught, I'm taking somebody camera, bro. I'm taking somebody. I'm, I'm leaving with at least one camera. Hey. Oh. 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 oh! Cameras don't follow, guys. Let them talk outside. You, you can go ahead and cut. Let me just make sure she's okay. Damn. That was a good video. Very entertaining, very fun. You know? Very relatable. Cause I still can't get a P5 either. Tell them blessings on one hand, but I'm grateful. When I make it home, look to the sky and I say thank you. I peeked the snakes up in the grass, I couldn't play cool. If they put the up and leave, nigga, they was mental.